Hey beautiful souls, beautiful sunshine here with the R Holistic Hilla, aka Sonia B. I am back with another prophetic message that I received this morning. I just want to basically excuse me, y'all. I just came from outside walking my dog, so it's cold outside. So, you know, we use um yeah, anyway. So with all that being said, remember, don't focus on what it is that I'm wearing. The just focus on the message. That's what's important. Um, I just want to basically let you guys know. That the revelation that came to me this morning, I saw an image of somebody sitting up on a high chair. When I say a high chair, I don't mean a high chair for a baby, you know, to boost them up to the table. This was like a high bar stool type chair. They were sitting in one of those. And then all of a sudden it switched from that to a low sitting chair. So the message that I had received after seeing that was... Uh, Basically, the Divine Spirit of Light said some of you, some people have been up on uh, a high, have been pacing themselves up on a high pedestal, throne, or whatever you want to call it, pedestal, um, is what I was getting. But he said some of you are about to be humbled. So don't shoot the messenger. I'm just giving a message. So I'm just letting you know it's like a warning so I just wanted to share that with you guys. And not only that, but I also received another dream too. It's almost like confirmation. So in this dream, I had saw basically that so much is going to change and it's going to be so quick in so many people's lives. Like it's going to just change like instantly. I just saw stuff being torn away and stuff being rebuilt. Um, like I saw it was an image of grass was there at one point, but then all of a sudden, like they just poured cement all over the grass and made concrete, you know, and it was like a tearing down of an old fence and rebuilding a new fence and just making things a lot more beautiful, should I say. But I can't tell you how it's going to show up in your life. Everybody's situation is going to be different. I just wanted to get you guys the message. Um, today I got a lot going on, so I figured I would just record this message and get it to you guys real quick, uh, before I get in and unwind from, you know, uh, walking my dog this morning. So, but anyway, with all that being said, uh, I hope this message is very helpful. So I'm not, I'm not trying to put fear in you guys. I'm just letting you know what's to come. So again, Take it how it resonates. If you're somebody who's been pretty much standing in your integrity and um, doing what's right, uh, you know, you should probably be fine. You know, if you're somebody who has been kind of up on a high horse and looking down on other people, then I can't say how your life is going to turn out. It's not for me to say that for anyone, but I'm just basically just giving the message. But with all that being said, you know, because we're all learning soul lessons and everybody's situation is going to come through different. You know, some people have experienced certain situations, you know, that caused them to have to rebuild their life all over again. And some people, you know, have been having the luxury of just, you know, having to not have to struggle at all. So, you know, from what I saw, like the, you know, things are going to kind of switch. And I kind of got this message some time ago, too, where I saw that, uh, there was like a switching of energy. Like if you were somebody who kind of thrived before, that energy is is, is like it's going to switch over to another individual. Uh, that might be, I think that was a message I might have put up on Patreon some time ago. So if you want to hear that message, you can go check it out. But anyway, with all that being said, I'm going to end it here because I know yesterday the video I did was pretty long and I wasn't even so expecting that, but I felt like I was divinely guided to do that. Um, so keep that in mind and remember in that video, I see it kind of ties into this one because God wanted to know it was more so of you asking yourself, are you honoring God? And again, it's not me judging. I'm not judging anyone. I'm, this is just a message that just came through. This is what God, I guess, wanted to, wanted me to share basically to give you stuff to think about. So anyway, with all that being said, I wish you all much love, much light, and I hope you guys have a beautiful day, and I say peace and blessings to you always, and I'm wishing you much love on your soul's journey. Bye.